I get it. I'm uncultured. Gosh, I know. I know. I know. Welcome back! What's up guys, it's Ange, and today we're gonna be watching a movie! What? You still do those, Ange? No way! <laughs> you read the title correctly. I have never seen Scott Pilgrim. I understand a lot of references, and I've seen clips here and there. I get it, I get it. I remind you of Ramona Flowers because my hair freaking changes so much, I get it. I heard it's good, I heard it's a classic, I heard it's must-see, so here I am. But before we begin, make sure you guys hit that subscribe button if you haven't yet already so you can stay tuned to all of my content i post three times a week follow me on all my social media all my handles will be in the description below and follow me on twitch i live stream every tuesday wednesday and sunday the stream schedule is going to be changing soon wednesday is going to be thursday yay, yay, yay you guys heard this Alrighty, y'all let's jump straight into the commentary here we go whoa it's pixelated oh my gosh i love this the video game vibes oh my gosh not so long ago oh in the mystique yo i love the video game vibes already scott canada pilgrim was dating a high schooler hi scott scott pilgrim is dating a high schooler how old are you now scott like 28 what <laughs> 22. rating awesome oh my gosh i love this is she a minor? Still not okay. Low key a case. Have you even kissed her? We almost held hands once, but then she got embarrassed. Oh, it's so wholesome. Knives Chow. Her name is Knives. A weapon. That's for me. Slash kitchen tool. Oh, she's 17. Of course I'll be good. Okay. Seriously, please be good. Am I normally not? Am I normally not? Wait, this is so funny. Wait, the little character cards and that ding dong animation. Amazing. I want her to geek out on us. She'll geek. She geeks. She has the capacity to geek. We love geeks, but 17, 22. Knives, that's young Neil. Why young Neil, not normal Neil? What do you play? I still can't get over the fact that her name is Knives. Zelda. Yes, Zelda! Yes, Tetris! Tetris is making a comeback. Hey, the zoom cuts! The animations! I love this. Oh my god, the art is incredible! The pan out! Yo, they extended the room and they rolled it out. Wait, please tell me this is a real room that they extended or something. I'm... Digging the style of this movie already. It's amazing. I just... Chris Evans is in this... Anna Kendrick is in this film? Brie Larson is in this film? What is going on? All right, maybe I am uncultured. Aubrey Plaza? Okay, I'm totally kidding. I guess I am not ready for this film because I'm already blown away by it. I'm obsessed. Edgar Wright. You guys are so awesome. Amazing. Let's freaking go. I mean, are you really happy or are you really evil? Wounded even? Yo, what is up with Kim? Why is she like that? Ah, oh, the lighting cues. Totally my bitch forever. Who is this? Oh my God. The error noise is amazing. Oh, hold on. I need a video game vibes, comic book vibes, computer, Wallace shelf, Wallace, books and CDs, Wallace, television, Wallace, video game systems and games, Wallace, Scott's coat. <laughs> Wallace's coat better. <laughs> that The details are amazing and it's just for a second, but it, it's like, it's so worth the pause. You know me. I mean, don't tell my sister. No me. 17 years old. Wallace, duh. That gossipy. Anna! It's been over a year since you got dumped by she who will not be named. Are you legitimately moving on or is this just you? <laughs> Wait, that's Brie Larson. Oh my gosh, I'm dying. This is amazing. Anna Kendrick plays his little sister. 
it's funny and it's quirky and the style is great. It just reminds me of a video game or like a comic book or a graphic novel or something. It's amazing. Did you know that the original name for Pac-Man was Pac-Man? In the Japanese phrase, Paku Haku, which means to flap one's mouth open and close. <laughs> They thought that Pac-Man would be too easy to vandalize. Oh, that's pretty freaking funny. Oh. Yo! They got moves! Uh, we love that. Have you tried the section marked The Clash at Demon Head? Hi, Aubrey. Go out with a lot of guys? I've never even kissed a guy. Me neither. <laughs> what is this? The dialogue! Oh my gosh, it's actually pretty quirky and funny. It's like not even like hysterical or anything, but the delivery and everything, it just works. I love it. But do you want to see the house where I grew up? There you go. What a cute looking house. We love it. I feel like Knives finds everything freaking amazing. Whoa, what is happening? Oh, okay, oh cinematic ratio. What is happening? So alone. You're just having some idiotic dream. A dream? Who are you? And what is it, Scott? I had this totally weird- What is happening? Oh. These transitions to scenes are insane. Oh my gosh. It's like six in the morning. <laughs> what? These freaking transitions are amazing. Yo, Scott sounds like he's in pain constantly, no matter what he's talking about. There she is, the girl from his dream. Do you know that girl? Uh-oh. Scott, what? <gasps> Yo! I'll be quieter. Oh my god, she's like whispering. The transition of these scenes are amazing. I can't get enough. I can't get enough of it. They're like super fast scenes, but they're conveying just like Scott being distracted and then the story's moving on and then they always use like an audio cue or a visual thing or something and it works. It works. I don't know how it works, but it works. Hey, Kama, you know everyone, right? Yeah, pretty much I do. This one knows everyone. Yes, that's Ramona Flowers. Stop! How does he know? Yo, he's so intrigued by her. Yo, the little whoosh is the whoosh whoosh. Whenever his eyes change his directions, amazing. He found her. Hey, what's up? The text. Oh gosh, so clean, so clean. You see the text erase as he comes close to like her was originally called Puckman, not because Pac-Man looks like a hockey puck, and that they were worried, scratch out the P, turn it into an F. Yo, he's trying his best. I'll leave you alone forever now. Thanks. Dude, what? She's totally real. Who? Ramona Flowers. <laughs> dude, what do you know about Ramona Flowers? <laughs> Lady dudes. What do you know Lady about Ramona dudes. Flowers? Lady dudes. The script is witty. Bro. Scott, I forbid you from hitting on Ramona. Yo, the zoom in, the dim lighting. I wonder if they did that in actuality or if that's all editing. Besides, I'm not even sure she did have a big breakup. I'm mentioning some guy named Gideon. Girl. Forget it, Scott. The accents with the art. Oh my gosh. Wait, I need to pause for a second. I'm kind of obsessed with this film so far because of the way that it's just kind of like the pacing of it and the it's almost it's like kind of poetic the way that the the scenes are being shot at me and i'm very overwhelmed but it's kind of just like boom 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 and the dialogue fits the style fits you can t tell that they put so much time and effort into this because of like think of all the cuts all the zooms all the freaking the lighting the art and the words and the freaking sound effects i am digging this so hard and it's only been 15 minutes. I'm gonna let it all out now that I love all of those shots and the words and everything because I know I'm just gonna talk about that the entire film. If I don't just let it out right now, this is really cool so far. I didn't know it was gonna be this intense with how much the effort they put into the, just the cinematics of this. So yeah, I wanna put that out there now that I love it. Good, now you guys know. We can talk more about the story and the plot and the characters. Okay, great, good. He's, I think she's the girl in my dreams. You haven't even talked to her, dude. You haven't even spoken to Ramona and you think that she's the one? You're thinking of juggling two chicks. Not even. <laughs> oh, that's, she found out. You're right, I should send out a mass text about this, bye. The little sister character, amazing, amazing. This is, what? This is, Boring. Boring. <laughs> Acting on point. Deliverance from Michael here. 
You're supposed to pick me at the bus stop a half hour ago. Oh gosh. Oh no. He's forgetting about knives. That's sucky. And now she's all into Derek. Uh -huh. I want to talk about the camera again, but I told myself I wouldn't. But those side swoop transitions and the way it worked at the script was so clean. Okay. Scott, you got to break up with knives. Break up. Did he break up with her? Gosh. I got us a show. Oh my gosh, when? He didn't break up with her. Guys, don't do this. If you don't feel it just be straight up about it just be like i'm not into you anymore in a nicer way and then just cut it off and do if you like someone else do that just don't just be straight up don't string along don't do none of that no and we'll do everything i can to get out of this little group and come i have to pee dude if you prolong this knife seems like she's getting more and more into you dude you need to like you need to settle this now the pee bar i'm dead Bar. What? <laughs> oh gosh. Yo, what? What? Oh my gosh. I love this. Oh, he's dreaming again. Uh, Scott Pilgrim? I was thinking about asking you out, but then I realized how stupid that would be. So do you want to go out sometime? Um, no. How did he dream that she was gonna be here? What? If I say yes, will you sign for your damn package? <laughs> Love that. Yo! The Scott Pilgrim, like, thing. First of all, his signature is beautiful. Why can't my signature look that freaking gorgeous? And, like, slick or whatever. Ugh. Was he your boyfriend? Do you mind if we don't get into that right now? Yo, he's going straight in for the deep questions. Love it. I, I respect her for actually showing up and hanging out with him. Just time to head somewhere a little more chilled. Well, it's certainly chilled here. It's Canada! It's chilled as in cold. I like cold. Better than hot. Leave a comment down below if, you, if you'd rather be hot or if you'd rather be cold. I would 100% rather be cold. Slip the tongue. Tongue. <laughs> Why did he repeat tongue? That's so awkward. But yes, of course, it's a date. He was literally like, I want to ask you out. What kind of tea do you want? There's more than one kind. Blueberry, raspberry, ginseng, sleepy time, green tea. Yes! Blueberry, chamomile, vanilla, walnut, constant comment, Earl Grey. Earl Grey is mwah, but also disappointed there's no oolong in there. Why did you think there's only one type of tea, Scott? Come on, you're telling me you're not that cultured? You're cheating on knives, though! Maybe we should both get under it since we're so cold. Oh my god, he's literally going for it! I changed my mind. Yes, girlfriend. You changed it to what? I don't want to have sex with Ramona is amazing. At least she knows what she wants when she wants it and expresses it in a blunt way. We love that. Low key. But he should not be there. No. Not without breaking up with knives first. Come on. Can I get your number? Wow. Girl number. <laughs> Girl number. Wait, fun fact. I want to I want to see the fun fact. The rocket. Fun fact. This place is a toy. I'm really upset at myself now for not having seen this film. Uh-oh. Oh! Do you like? Sir Kristen! Nice! I thought you weren't even in the holding hand stage! Oh, gosh. Oh, my gosh! It's so funny! Wallace looking at Jimmy! Scott, you're screwed! You are screwed! This is so, so bad. You know what's bad? Not the fact that you guys have stage fright, but literally the fact that he's seeing two girls at once. That sucks. You suck. It's hard for me to keep track sometimes because he has so many friends. Oh no, oh no. This is a nightmare. <laughs> we need to play now and loud. One, two, three, four. You're screwed, Scott, but let's go. She passed out. Oh, my God, it's stuck. oh, the little harmony. We love it. Hey, they sound pretty freaking good. Mr. Pilgrim. What is going on? Hi, Matthew Patel. What is happening? What? Hello? How did they film this? Oh my gosh, I love it. I'm obsessed. Oh my 
my gosh! And I'm Ramona's first ex-boyfriend. I love this head thing that he's doing. He's so good at this. When the title of this was Scott Pilgrim vs. The World, I didn't think he was actually going to be fighting people. Didn't you get my email explaining the situation? Oh, you boy. Will pay for your insulin. Yo, this Matthew Patel actor is great. I love it. He's very into it, which is super fun. Yo, this choreography, though. they really, You can really tell they put a lot of effort into this, too. Pirates are in this year? He doesn't even look that much like a pirate. What makes him piratey? Matthew was the only non-white, non-jock boy in town. So the two of us joined forces, and we took them all down. These drawings, I love them. They're so cute. Oh my gosh, poetic. See, this is what I said. I told him to hit the showers. Dude, wait. Mystical powers? You'll pay for this, flowers. Poetic. I love this film. Why is he breaking out to song? The head thing. The freaking head thing. I'm dead. This is impossible. How can this be? <laughs> the inner dialogue too. They have everything. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, the coins! The coins! I'm actually... I'm actually dying. Oh yeah, so my gosh. Sex bob -omb wins. Yay! Good job, Sex bob -omb. If we're gonna date, you may have to defeat my seven evil exes. Mm, dating? Uh, I guess. Does that mean we can make out? Sure. Cool. This movie, what is happening? Ramona, why are you even going out with him? Someone's lucky then. The audience cheering. Oh my gosh, I'm dead. I got to second base last night. Maybe first and a half. <laughs> the sick on vibes right now. Base cut. The click stopping the, the laughing cue. Did you guys hear that? Did you guys see that? That was so freaking good. Break up with knives today. True! How have you not broken up with her yet? Literally, what's the reason? Now you listen close and you listen hard, bucko. Chris Evans, I'm dying! Badass freaking what, 11 years ago? And a dorky hat. Why are you psychic? Hey! <gasps> That's not scary. That's not creepy. Will you take me to the show? Oh my gosh, just break up with her. Just break up with her already. Too old for you. No, you're not. Can you even just say, your just say, just say that you want to break up with her. Oh my God, stop looking for excuses, Scott. <gasps> no. We should break up or whatever. He did it. He waited till she was freaking in love with him. Oh, poor knives. Yes, like you said. The new hair. You know your hair? I change my hair every week and a half, dude. Get used to it. Every week and a half. Yes. Doing okay there? Yeah, good, good, good. His apron, I'm dead. She changed her hair. She did it without even making a big deal of it or anything. She's fickle. Is he scared that she's gonna leave him? That's definitely it. No, why would I get fat? Bread makes you fat. Bread makes you fat? <laughs> I can't with this. The script is amazing. It's hilarious. Mom. God is acutely aware that his last salon haircut placed exactly 431 days ago. <laughs> Why does he associate his haircut with his breakup? Oh gosh, Scott. Sort of seem a little brighter. What is this place? As it literally gets brighter on the screen. So good. So extra and I love it. Mr. Lee? Lucas Lee. Oh. Is it another X? I'm gonna die if it's another X. What's up, Captain America? Skater boy, I'm dead. What is that face he's making? Hey, I'm talking to you, Scott Pilgrim. I love the extraness of that. Chris Evans just literally yeeted him like it was nothing. Maybe he still is Captain America. Oh my gosh, this is foreshadowing it. God, this movie had to have been such a fun freaking, like, thing to film. Why did they do his eyebrows like that? That's a waste of a perfectly good coffee cup. But are you a pretty good skater? Chris Evans, man, good, I can't. Can you do a thingy on that rail? It's called a grind, bro. Grindy thingy? He's gonna die. Look at all that snow. 
Oh no! Oh, this is so epic! Wow. <laughs> wow. <laughs> I can't! That's so funny! <laughs> but, <laughs> After every rail and it cuts, all the audio cuts, the music cuts, and he's just like, wow. Woo. My cheeks hurt from laughing so much. Oh my gosh. If you want something bad, you have to fight. True. Break out the L word. Oh. Lesbian. The other L word. Lesbians. <laughs> Lesbians in plural. Whoever wrote the script. Be with her. It's your destiny. Be different from all those other seven guys that went out with her. I'm not saying say I love you if you don't mean it, obviously, but like you do have to be different from the other guys. Hey. Hey, Scott. Envy. Brie Larson! What's your name? I'm not telling you that. Ramona. <laughs> oh, gosh. I gotta go. It's been nice chatting with you. Wait. So dramatic! Oh, gosh. Brie Larson looks so little. Oh, my gosh. Which makes sense. It was 10 years ago, but damn. Hello? Oh, hey, Knives. Dude, the drama is actually kind of great. Uh, you know what? He just left. <laughs> I know that that I know that meme. I know that reference of him jumping out the window. <laughs> so good. I need to watch that again. I need to watch that again. That was iconic. Scott here. Uh, you know what? He just left. The comedic timing of that is great. It's great. The the running steps and then the ch he just left. Great. The timing of it was perfect too. The deadpan face of Wallace. Is there another guy now? Third guy? So did the other exes have to defeat, you know, the other boys too? Like number three has to deal with two and one. Six had to deal with five, four, three, two, one. Gosh, that's probably exhausting. The first boyfriend, Matthew Patel, probably had to go through freaking all the boyfriends. Do you think he did that number every single time too? Jeez. Mad respect for Matthew Patel. Prepare to die, obviously. Oh my gosh! What's her name again? She was in the Duff. She's a great actress. Is she also an ex? Shit. It's my ex. Hi, Envy. Oh no. Okay, I'm jealous. She's jealous? Oh my gosh. Great. You're so on the list. I love her jacket. I want her jacket. <gasps> Envy asked us to open for them. Oh hey, no. Gig is a gig is a gig is a gig. Can't we do our own secret shows? All our shows are secret shows. I mean, it's gonna be a lot of exposure for the band. Just avoid Envy, you know? Just try not to look at her. <laughs> I'm dying. She's probably like 25. Oh, poor Knives. I think you mentioned she was fat. First of all, she is not fat. Oh my God, she's dying her hair. Young Neil, OMFG, you're so hot! Oh my gosh! She's gonna use Neil? Oh gosh, Knives, why? Oh goodness, this isn't toxic at all. That guy on base, that's Todd. I know! That's the same Todd that she dated? I love this! I love it! Oh my gosh! Every guitar strum. Can we talk about how great the music is in this film? I'm obsessed with her shoes. I don't have the legs for it, but they're cute. Envy Adams would like you all to come backstage. Why does she work everywhere? No Envy. Scott dated her. <laughs> the sound effect. Oh my gosh, so good. How dare you? You punched the highlights out of her hair. What? How is that even possible? Pay for your crimes against humanity. What? Yes, Bowers. Wow, fun. He is levitating, Scott. How? You know, Todd's vegan. What does vegan have anything to do with it? I'll take you on the soy. Actually, muchacho. I poured the soy in this cup. You just drank half and half, baby. Three vegan police! Vegan police! I'm dead! <laughs> Stop! Why? D-Vegan Eggs Ray. Hit him. 
How sad. Tragic, truly, truly tragic. Good job, Scott. Scott beating the opponents in a creative way, using his brain, his wits, is amazing. I love it. <gasps> no, he doesn't have excellent hair anymore. Gone, but now you will be gone. Be gone. Whatever he can do to make it, you know, rhyme. You just headbutted my boyfriend so hard he burst. Into coins, at least. You can keep the change. This ex-boyfriend's thing is messing with my head. Exes. Why do you keep saying- Oh, ouch. Who are you? Why do you keep coming back? Girl from earlier? The inner dialogue gets me every time. The best form of narration. I like this kind of narration. You and her? It was just a phase. Just a phase? <laughs> gets it. I'm dead. Well, then Gideon best get his pretentious ass up here because I'm about to kick yours out of the great white north. Yo, she has a hammer. This is great. We have a battle with freaking Ramona going against one of her exes. That's amazing. Yo, one has a whip and one has a freaking hammer. This is the coolest fight in the whole movie. Hands down. Even the guy with the hair. Even, even Chris Evans. This is better than the Chris Evans fight. <laughs> what? Why? How? I don't even understand. What? Okay, was that four, right? Yeah, that's four. We got three more. The fact they are able to also do this like relationship conflict and growth thing between Ramona and Scott is really great. It's really great because they're able to fit this between all the fights. Just, just another evil ex waiting to happen. <gasps> oh, punch in the gut. They are totally badass. Oh Ramona no. At the same time. You know what? It br I really hope it wasn't at the same time. I feel like this is gonna be so cool. I'm so excited for this. I hope the songs like don't compliment each other at all. They only press two freaking notes. We are sex bubbles and we're here to make you think about death and get sad and stuff. Yo, I love the music of this movie. Dude, those dragons are actually epic. What is even their music? I don't hear any music on the con uh, twins. I don't hear the twins' music at all. That geeky guy next to your girlfriend. That's Gideon? Oh no. You can beat these dragons? What? These dragons are nothing. Yes, let's go, gorilla monster beast thing. This is great, epic. I wish I could see this in theaters or something. It, it was probably so cool looking. And the sound was probably amazing. The music slaps. Yes. What are you doing? Getting a life. Getting a life, get it? Ah, good one, Scott. Good one. Because I'm in lesbians with you. <laughs> I'm in lesbians with you. The L word. I get it. The L word. I have to break up. <gasps> what? It's Gideon. What about him? Oh no. I can't help myself, Ramona, why? And sign, sign, and we are all set. No, Ramona, why? You clearly like Scott. Why are you going with this Gideon dude? I guess it all shakes out, huh? Yo, these twists too? I said lesbians. Yeah, yeah, you did. It's okay, I think she understood what you meant. Oh, ow, that sounded like it really hurt. Oh, the song he wrote for her is playing. Ow, dude, you're really thonking your head. That is definitely killing brain cells. Are you a big guy? Hello? Are you with me? Yeah. It's gonna be all right. Don't pet her like that. Forget what I said earlier. Finish him. Let's go. Tying the shoe, I'm dead. <laughs> and the music with the zoom in when he finishes the knot. Genius. Genius. Coke Zero, right? Oh, 
he went there. Well, I've got no beef with you. You have a lot of beef with you. Lot of beef. It is cooking. It he you are churning the beef, bro. The lady made her choice. Don't stroke her head, I swear. I swear, if you touch her head one more time, dude, I'm gonna come there and I'm gonna... Burst, okay? I'm gonna... Straight across the temple, dude. You done, Gideon. <gasps> the L word! Hey, Level up! I love he gained a weapon from that. We are here to make money and sell out and stuff. The subtle middle finger, I'm dead. Good tunes and a good fight scene. <laughs> the coins being in outlines of dead bodies. Do you guys see that? Oh, knives! What up, knives? Listen, Kung Pao Chicken. <gasps> Bro, don't be racist! Oh gosh, just, oh no, I hated that. I don't like that line at all. Please, Hollywood. Maybe I forgot to tell Knives right away. Oh no. She did it on me, Scott. Scott. Game. <gasps> Yo! No way! He's not dead. Look, he's, he's back in his dream world. He's just a little bit tired. That's it. He's been he's fighting like five of these guys now. So I had to leave. And that's when he started paying attention. Toxic! No, I mean, he literally has a way of getting into my head. What? That's not good. I feel like I learned something. What did you learn? He got an extra life! Let's freaking go! Take two! Oh, badass! You wanna fight me? For her? I wanna fight you for me. Scott earned the power of self-respect. The power of self-respect, buddy! Let's freaking go! Everything is slightly faster in this scene too. The tempo of the music, everything. That ass hurt me. And I will have my revenge. No knives, I hurt you. There we go. I cheated on both of you. Learning his lesson and quite literally getting a second chance. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, very Naruto-esque. Oh, just kidding, uh, Star Wars-esque? But it's like a samurai sword, pixelated. I'm confused. It's just awesome. It's just awesome. Get him, Scott. Get him. Yes. Oh my gosh. The montage. The pictures. Oh my gosh. Would have never guessed. Oh, I love this. I literally have no words. That was the most epic freaking thing. The music is great. Visually stunning. I can't. This is that was so good. Pain in my ass. I wonder how they did this. Evil X is contacted to make it all pixely. I'm what's happening. I'm blowing up right now. Ooh, you if you hear, listen carefully. <laughs> Let's go. KO! If you guys listen to Gideon's audio right there, they freaking did the double audio and they added the later, the like distortion to it, which was so good. I love how there was like two of him speaking at the same time. It added to the distorted effect. Yay, a million coins! You two make a good combo. You can defeat me, Scott, but can you defeat yourself? What does that even mean? What? Hello? Why is there an evil Scott? I don't even understand. No, this is something I have to face. Oh gosh, his learning curve. Oh no, the last boss fight. The final, final boss fight. You get bacon on the side. Oh, I'm liking that, yeah. Next week, yeah, okay, cool. Yeah, all right, be good, yeah. Stop, he like befriended him. You should probably disappear. No, stop. Okay. Stop trying to disappear. I'm tired of people getting hurt. Stop! Is she gonna leave? For being the nicest guy I ever dated. Aww, that's cute. I like that. I like that. I like that. Oh. Bye and stuff? Bye and stuff. That's it? That's it? You guys are gonna say goodbye? How sad. You've been fighting for her all along. True. Girl of your dreams, bro. 
Oh, Knives! Knives is like giving her blessing! I'm too cool for you anyway. Yeah, she is! Go get Ramona! You've literally been pining over her. Oh, maybe we could try again. Aww. There we freaking go. Now that's what I call a freaking resolution, okay? The sun rising in the back. Snow becoming petals of flowers. Oh, I love that! That was so good! Oh, what a wonderful surprise of a freaking film. I was told it was great, and I knew that I kept hearing it, and everyone's like, you gotta watch it. Like, what are you doing? And I now understand what everyone is saying. I have not stopped laughing the entire movie. My face legitimately hurts from all the laughter and all the fun, like, giggles I had throughout the entire thing. Very feel-good movie. Movie. It was so creative. I've never seen a film like this ever in my life and there needs to be more films like this that just breaks conventionality tradition. It just breaks tradition and it's entertainment at its finest. It's fast paced. It's witty. The script exists so well with the freaking visuals and camera work, action and choreography, and it's again, like I said in the middle of the film, it's poetic, quite literally. Like, the scene just bounces and bounces and transitions and transitions, and it's almost like the movie is just dancing along to its own rhythm, and I love it! And I can't believe I didn't watch this sooner, but now that I have, I feel fulfilled, I feel happy, I'm so glad. I'll definitely be watching this multiple times in the future. Oh man. And can I just give a huge round of applause to the freaking actors in this movie? Leave a comment down below what you guys thought of this movie when you first saw it. Were you like, whoa, this is nothing like I've ever seen before? Did you not like it first and then start to like it? Like, give me all your thoughts and your opinions. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed this commentary, make sure you leave it a big thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't yet already so you can stay tuned to all of my content. And don't forget to check out my last video. Alrighty, y'all. Have the bestest day ever. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye. Okay, bye, okay, bye, okay, bye.